Well, hello and welcome to the BI WizKid. Okay, today, so we're going to quickly show you how to create a date table. A date table usually required in a in a BI uh, in a BI solution. Uh, usually, one of the dimensions that you need is a, is a date dimension. So what we're going to do here, instead of having to use the calendar function that we have within Power BI, what we're going to do is import a function and invoke that function within around 10 seconds. Uh, and then instead of having to create each and every column of the date table yourself, you'll have it created for you, for you to use. Okay, so what we're going to do is grab this code that we need. And this goes out to the Geeks with Blogs, Matt Mason and Chris Webb who deserve the credit for this. Uh, the link will be pasted below this video for you to grab. Okay, so what I'm going to do is get data, blank query, go into my query editor and go into advanced editor. Okay, remove whatever's in there, paste whatever's here, click OK and straight away I get my start date, so I want to start from. I'm going to go back to 2005 because I'm working on the AdventureWorks dataset. I'm going to go up to 2008. 01. Actually, let's go to 31st 12, 2008. Okay. I'm going to click invoke. Boom. There's our date table, January, etc., Q1, etc., etc., end of week, ISO week, week number, period, etc., etc. Okay, um, call this date table, close and apply, and within a few seconds, we shall have our newly created date table, which is ready to use. Okay, and thanks for watching. See you in the next video.